Okay, this is all being filmed on my old HTC Wildfire, which is as close to a smartphone as I'll agree to get. And the camera's not the best. But here's the uh, the print sitting on the bed of the uh, the works velman with my craft bot behind it. And I didn't quite follow the settings um, from the uh, the slicer 
showdown. Uh, this was done on a 0.3 millimeter layer height, partly due to um, not wanting it to take too long to print, but also that's the settings that were in the system. Um, it wasn't printed with a raft, it was printed with a brim. Uh, had to let the, uh, and this is ABS, by the way. Um, it's the craft, uh, craft bot supplied, or sorry, craft unique supplied ABS. And uh, one of the things when you print a brim with craftware is it puts a brim on internal cavities as well as external in contrast to um, the slicer but I'm really quite impressed by this uh, no support material as you saw from the footage from when it was printing the columns printed albeit they got uh, pretty ugly right at the top um, the columns started swaying around under the print print loading so particularly the small ones pretty bad um, I don't think I've got the extrusion multiplier dialed and I've basically not touched that setting so the uh, the small hole is not quite um, all the way through the other two are, uh, are fine as uh, noted before, um, the 0.4 millimeter wall didn't print, um, although the extrusion width um, defaults to 0.4. Um, so I haven't played around trying to solve that. But I mean, that front overhang, no support material, that's as crisp as anything. And likewise, this rear curve looks pretty good peering up inside the cavity there's a bit of stringing um, and then the bridging's not bad at all and the bridging up here there's just a little bit of sag on the very first um, oops putting quite a lot of force on that thin tower shows how strong the ABS can be there's a seam on the back um, as I haven't touched the um, randomizing the, the scene points and then the scene shifts round to this position and um, Craftware has settings for um, when it starts and stops extruding on, on perimeters to, uh, to limit blobbing and I think uh, it's actually leaving a slight gap if anything on that point just trying to yeah it 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 is leaving a very slight slight gap so obviously that's uh, a setting that can be optimized and the the front there is, is pretty fat I think it's very slightly over extruding the, uh, the top surface down here is not the uh, not the smoothest The letters came out uh, pretty good. Overall, I'm quite impressed with the the, the craft box, and uh, just thought it would be interesting to you know use use craftware and output on a on a craft box as a comparison.